Hi, this is Bas De Panda. Welcome to Master English. Today, I'll tell you about gender. Gender, as you know, gender of noun. Gender of what noun? Yes or no? So, before I'll start the topic, I may request you that if you are new to the channel, please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon that you can get all the notification. Okay, and don't forget to like the videos. So, let me tell you, what is a gender? What is gender? A gender is exactly, it's nothing but by which we identify the sex of a noun, okay, uh, whether it is a male, female, okay, that is called your gender. So, gender in English are divided into four types, okay. The gender in English uh, is divided into four types. In, you know, Tamil, Telugu, Sanskrit, or all Indian language, there are three types of gender masculine feminine and neuter but in english you know there are four gender what are those four gender first one is your you know male you can say male or it stands for masculine gender masculine okay then number two is female female or feminine feminine okay number three is your you know neuter uh, you can say neuter. Neuter means you know the non-living things, non-living things. And number four is your which one? It is your common, common gender. Uh, that indicates both male indicates indicates you know male and female, male and female okay so what depends so i hope you understood what are you know the gender in english gender as i've told you gender indicates the sex of a noun and through which uh, we indicate so we can recognize the sex of a noun that's called your gender so what happens here male in english gender is divided into four type male female neuter and common male stand for masculine gender Male stand for masculine gender like man, boy, son. Okay, these are what all father. These are all your male gender. And female means it stand for feminine gender like you know mother, sister, daughter. We are using grandmother. These are all your what feminine gender. And neuter gender. What is a neuter gender? Neuter gender or you can say this marker. Marker is your neuter gender. Copy. Copy is your neuter gender. Okay. Uh, let me write male, you know, man, father, father, son, etc. Then, you know, female gender, if mother, then woman, daughter, etc. Then neuter, as I was telling, non living thing, like you can uh, tell your pen, chair, copy. Okay, these are what? These are your yeah, neuter gender. And the last one is common gender. Common gender means that indicates, as I have written, that indicates both the gender. Both the gender means, you know, it stands for, it is that word if it is used for men and female. That is your what? Common gender. Like, suppose I am telling student. Student. Look at this. Student. So, what happens here? Student. Student. Uh, even if we are telling a girl a student, a boy is a student, whoever it may be, we are just calling student. You can take the example of teacher even if teacher. So we are not telling lady teacher or gents teacher. We are telling simply teacher. Ma'am is also a teacher. You know, sorry is also a teacher. So this is what we call common gender. That means common gender means in common. The words use, uh, you know, are the noun that is used for both male and female. That is for your common gender. So that's all for today. Uh, in the next class, we'll see the number of noun. Keep watching and stay tuned with Pandasa with Master of English. Thank you.